Hey guys, Paul Durham here. I wanted to read this to you from the Word of God. It's in 1 Corinthians chapter 9. It's verses 19 through 23. Apostle Paul speaking to the Corinthians. And he says, Even though I am a free man with no master, I have become a slave to all people to bring many to Christ. When I was with the Jews, I lived like a Jew to bring the Jews to Christ. When I was with those who followed the Jewish law, I too lived under that law. Even though I am not subject to the law, I did this so I could bring to Christ those who are under the law. When I am with the Gentiles who do not follow the Jewish law, I too will live apart from that law so I can bring them to Christ. But I do not ignore the law of God, I obey the law of Christ. When I am with those who are weak, I share in their weaknesses, for I want to bring the weak to Christ. Yes, I try to find common ground with everyone, doing everything I can to save some. I do everything to spread the good news and share in its blessings. You hear the heart of the apostle, who was an evangelist also, bringing people to Christ. And that's what our ministry is all about at Ripe for Life. It is to go out, work with churches, mobilize churches to get the whole church to reach their whole city with the whole gospel. We work toward those means to bring people to Christ. Nothing in life is more important than that. And that's our calling. So you know we have a few initiatives coming up. Next month, actually this month, the end of this month, May, next month, June, uh, uh, Kenya will be in Kenya. Two big festivals working with multiple evangelists, the Global Network of Evangelists, and many others to reach thousands, thousands for Christ. And over the whole summer and at the end, when Andrew Palau goes there in September, there'll be over hundreds of thousands of people hearing the gospel. We can have our part in it. We need $20,000 is our commitment to that for resources. Uh, we have some of that has came in, but much of it has not yet. So I'm asking you to please pray about that initiative. And if you have the means and God puts it on your heart to give toward that cause, you too will be helping us bring people to Christ. Later on in October, Athens, Texas. I just got back from there with a pre-trip. Everything's going good. I'm so excited about what God's doing in Texas and in the United States. And then toward the end of the year, back to the country of Moldova. So God bless you guys. Please pray about these needs and uh, give and pray and go with me sometime if you can as God would lead you. That's all I ask. We want what the Lord wants and we know he wants us to seek and save the lost, preach the gospel and bring people to Christ.